Today we shall learn a simple method of using WordPress credentials to log into your custom application. You may ask, well, why we should use this? The reason is because WordPress is an open source script which is constantly improving and has a strong security. So we have created a folder called app inside the blog directory wherein we have installed WordPress. Let's call it loginform.php. This is a basic simple HTML login form to collect username and password from the user. So think this as our custom application login form. We'll, we will collect username and password from the user here and pass it on to a WordPress core file, a function of WordPress and check if the username and password combination exists in the database of the WordPress. So what we have basically in this form is just two fields, username and password. We give unique names to these input fields so that we can collect this in login.php file that we are about to write in action field of this form. So before that let's see how the design looks in the browser. Localhost slash blog where we have WordPress installed slash app here is our application inside app folder. So this is what we wrote just now, username, password and a submit button. Once we hit the submit button, the username and password is passed to login.php file with post method. So now we will write this login.php file. Let's save this file inside our custom application directory that is app folder this first step is very important that is you need to include you require a core wordpress file here that is wp hyphen let's look at the name here wp hyphen blog hyphen header dot php app is the folder inside which you have stored login.php so this wp-blog-header.php is the wordpress core file which you need to include in your custom application file since we are having app inside app folder inside the blog folder we need to step one step backward to include this file that is dot dot slash so this will include wp hyphen blog hyphen header dot php in our application now we write our usual php core since we are using post method here in this form form so we write dollar underscore post here also let's take password now now comes another important part user underscore pass underscore ok is the function of wordpress you need not know what's the code inside this function just pass the username and the password to this function and it will tell if this username password combination is present inside your WordPress installation or not. It basically checks against the database of your WordPress installation for the username and password combination that you are passing here. So if this username and password combination is not present in the dat WordPress database I'll simply echo a message login failed else 
if this username password combination is present then I will say successful login maybe or welcome user ID to customize the welcome message so instead of this echo you can do a redirection of the page or whatever you want basically what we are showing here is the authentication part reload the file let's test it for invalid username and password I'll give ABC and 1 to 3 it's invalid so it should say login failed okay great now let's create a username and password password WordPress is installed at localhost slash blog let me create a username now add a user first let me call it the username as mark small letter m a r k remember these are case sensitive so password is one two three four let it be subscriber itself oh email is mandatory here mark at technotip.com add the user now test the application with username as mark and password one two three four it should say welcome mark great it's working so basically what we do is use this simple login form with username and password fields using post method we send the username and password to login.php file wherein the first line of code is to include wp iphone blog iphone header.php a core wordpress file and pass the username and password username and password to user underscore pass underscore ok function of wordpress that's it thanks for watching please click on like and please share this video with your friends and visit technotip.com and technotip.org thanks for watching